My name is Tammy Boyd. I am here to inform you of the many dangers of hazing. I want to end these rituals that can potentially lead to harm. I remember watching the news almost three years ago in 2011. I was literally frozen watching the parents of Robert Champion speak out about his death at the hand of his band members. He was a victim of hazing. He was beaten with band equipment as he walked on the bus. He was kicked and then after he got off the bus, he passed, he just collapsed. Hazing is the practice and rituals and other activities involving harassment, abuse, or humiliation used as a way of initiating a person into a group. It often leads to mental and or physical pain. Hazing can also lead to death. I have watched endless students that have been victimized by hazing incidents. I've seen this covered on the news and some of the students ended up dead. Some ended up with alcohol poisonous, poisoning and some ended being mentally scarred. By ending hazing, we do not end the camaraderie, but the potential harm. We need to implement mandatory classes to teach in schools about hazing. Also, we need stiffer laws, stiffer punishment. I feel by educating about hazing, this will decrease the amount of injuries and deaths. If we do not take action, it's going to lead to numerous amount of mental and or physical pain and death. We need to have zero tolerance, which means we need to push for tougher laws on hazing. Tougher laws will discourage the engagement of hazing. By implementing this anti-hazing law will save lives, will decrease senseless deaths. If we do not change or make changes to, we'll, lo we'll lose too many lives. I need each one of you to contact your senator about stiffer penalties on hazing. Last, speak out. Speak out against the violence and the death. Again, we need stiffer laws. Please contact your senator against hazing. Thank you.